Hey the One Piece, the gameplay for the brand new Superstars and Moose Pack DLC continues this time with Biggie Langston versus Brock Lesnar. Now, before I get to talking about whatever I'm going to talk about, I want you guys right now in the comments section, post your comments and tell me which match you want to see me play with the brand new DLC characters. Is there a certain dream match you'd like to see involving, I don't know, Biggie Langston or Fandango or the Bell Twins or whatever? You want to see Biggie Langston versus, I don't know, John Cena or Biggie Langston versus this person or that person? Do you want to see Fandango versus uh, a member of 3MB or something like that? Whatever you want to see involving the new characters, just tell me in the comments section. And uh, maybe if you're quick enough, or if, you know, if I like the idea, I'll post up a video of that. Of course, that would be for single player, seeing as how I can't really control what other players pick on online. I can't tell them, hey, uh, or I can't make them pick, you know, somebody or a character. They pick who they want. But actually, I did used to do that. <laughs> I did used to do that. For those of you who've been with this channel for a while or who've been following following me for a while, watching my videos for a while, and you remember the old prediction game videos, I used to predict every single pay-per-view, all the simulations I would do, they would be online. And the way I would do that, it wasn't me facing off against a friend or something like that for him to pick, you know, uh, the, the appropriate character. I would actually freaking make a lobby, and then when somebody would join, I'd be like, hey, pick this character, please, or whatever, you know? And if they refuse I would just kick them out until somebody accepted and then I would have the match up recorded and post it up but uh, nowadays you know that's it, it's a it's a much that process is a lot takes a lot more time than just playing it on single player that's why right now I just do it at on single player it's just a lot easier it doesn't take as much time you don't have to count on somebody picking a certain character and then waiting for somebody to pick a certain character or just kicking people out, whatever. Anyways, I'm talking too much about things that are irrelevant to this video. This matchup is a match I would much prefer to see than, for for instance, Ryback versus Brock Lesnar. I know there's been like there was some rumors about Brock Lesnar possibly facing Ryback at like the Rumble or something like that. But uh, I mean, looking at what's happening right now on TV, I think those are just that rumors because i mean look at ryback right now he's like in a tag team with curse axel he's like he doesn't really he's not really involved in a certain storyline or a certain feud he's not necessarily winning a lot of matches i mean yeah he won on raw against kofi and the Miz, but at the same time you know that that's not like you know some main event superstars and it, it's 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 like his first win in a while i mean he hasn't had any like a big significant victory in a long time so as far as Ryback versus Brock Lesnar, just to me, it doesn't make sense, and only I, and also I just don't see it taking place. And nor do do I think the match would be very entertaining to watch. But on the other hand, if you, you know, if you want to have like a big man versus big man match or a Brock Le Brock Lesnar facing off against another big man, uh, Brock Lesnar versus Biggie Langston, I think that would be a lot better than Brock Lesnar versus Ryback. Uh, I just like Brock, I mean, I just like Biggie Langston's in-ring style a lot more than I do Ryback's. Uh, he, he, I feel Biggie Langston is a lot quicker. His matches are, are, are a lot quicker, too. Uh, whereas Ryback, I find he, he's a bit slower in the ring. Uh, he, he really takes his time. He, he does a, lo you know, some, a lot of super holds and this and that. It's, uh, his moveset isn't as exciting as Biggie Langston. That's, that's the best way I could put it. So, yeah. Anyways, yeah, this matchup, if you're not already aware, is an Extreme Rules match. It is no regular matchup. Uh, for some reason, whenever I play a match against Brock Lesnar in this video game, or play as Brock Lesnar in 2K14 or 13 or whatever, I tend to make the match Extreme Rules. Why? I'm a guy that likes to keep things realistic, and when you look at Brock Lesnar's matches since coming back, They've all been Extreme Rules matches or No Holds Barred matches, matches where you can use weapons. I was gonna say except for the CM Punk match, but that that match too became a No Holds Barred match the night of the show. It was supposed to be a normal match, but then they changed it to a No Holds Barred match. So yeah, every single match of Brock Lesnar so far 
has been the whole spark. So if Biggie Langston takes on Brock Lesnar in the future, I also think it is going to be in the whole spark. But as far as, you know, um, this match actually taking place, I'm thinking it's not going to be taking place. I think, you know, we're, we're probably going to see, as far as at least WrestleMania goes, because I know this is in the WrestleMania arena, I think it's going to be uh, Brock Lesnar versus The Undertaker. And so, yeah. And anyways, uh, to talk a bit about the DLC a bit, I know I said I would probably post up, or I said that my next matchup would probably be me playing as Fandango versus another character or something like that. But, I don't know, I was like, yeah, but, you know, Fandango, with Fandango, there's no real, like, dream matches. There's no, oh, I would love to see Fandango versus this other superstar of the past or this other popular superstar. Whereas with Biggie Langston, there's just so many matches I would, you know, like to see. Uh, for, for instance, you know, I th or, not, I'm not saying those matches would be, like, five-star matches, but I'm saying just, just... Because of the two characters involved, I think would be it would be just an interesting, I guess, concept or whatever. A match is like Big E versus Brock. Uh, Big E versus Ryback. Uh, for, for the simple fact that it's just, you know, two big guys facing off. And you want to see which one, you know, ends up being victorious. Wh who is the superior big guy or big man, I guess. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, yeah, I was playing as Big E Langston in this matchup. It is indeed on Legend difficulty, and uh, I ended up hitting two big endings in the match, because the first big ending I hit was when Brock Lesnar was, like, damaged to, um, he, he was, like, low damage, light damage, so he was on yellow, so no way was I going to, you know, pin him then, so I had to hit him with another one, you know what Biggie Langston's music says, one ain't enough, I need two. Doesn't really say that, says he needs five instead of three, but, you know, close enough. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, click that like button. With that said, I'm out. See you guys.